is Dawson Richard here once again for another LSU video. We are going to be talking about a certain topic here, right? And that is how consistent can LSU be, right? We saw that Florida game. We saw how consistent the offense was, right? Jane Daniels looked like the guy that was promised when he transferred here. Um, Keishon Butte finally looked like the first round talent that he is. So the question I have here, right, is for the rest of this season, right, can LSU stay consistent on offense, right? And I think this is a tough question because of where they play at, right? They play in the SEC, one of the toughest divisions in all of college football. If you don't believe me, there is a high possibility that the four-team playoff is all SEC teams if – Voters think that they are the worthy teams for it. There is a reality where that lives in that four teams from the SEC could be playing in the playoffs. So, with the rest of the schedule, you know, coming forward, can they be consistent with this offense? I, I, I honestly don't think Jane Daniels can throw for six touchdowns a game, right? But what I can expect from Jane Daniels, right? If, if I I just want from Jane Daniels and this right receiver group and all, all that. I just want half of that. Can you give me three touchdowns a game, right? Especially if the running game and some of these games match up, right? Can Kayshawn get a hundred yards again, right? I think that opens up a lot of stuff. Opens up stuff for Jenkins and the rest of this right receiver room. But. I think there's a, a thing we got to remind ourselves here with LSU this year, guys. Bear with me with this, right? This is a rebuilding year for LSU, right? Things aren't going to look pretty every single game, right? LSU is going to be winning games as long as the matchup makes it either a 50-50 chance or it's a favorable matchup for LSU in that situation. Tennessee was not a favorable matchup, and guess what? They got LSU got blown out. Florida was one. And they won the game, right? It was a, a bit of a tough win, but eventually they, you know, got the lead and got and scored them enough to win, right? So that's the thing, right? We are, I, it, there are some fans thinking, hey, if we go undefeated, we can get to the SEC championship game. And um, if you're expecting Ole Miss to lose two more games or if you're expecting to beat Alabama, um, Alabama played. Um, you know, Tennessee tough. I don't expect LSU to play Al Alabama as tough as Tennessee did if we can't even score that many points on Tennessee. But hey, rivalry games are rare, right? And SEC any given Saturday, right? That's, that's what favors LSU, right? And also night games and, you know, Death Valley. It, it, it helps out, right? But to summarize what I'm thinking here, the consistency probably will not be there. That's that's the thing. The consistency will not be there. The LSU is going to be playing their matchups, right? If the if the good matchups, they they're going to probably look like this. The bad matchups is going to look like Tennessee again, right? And and occasionally you're going to get a slugfest that is a very low scoring game, in which your field goal kicker has to make a kick in. Let's hope it doesn't reach that way. Because I honestly, I honestly like what I'm, I'm hearing, right? I'm hearing that the group has finally clicked. I I hear all this stuff, but you got to remind yourself as a fan. You got to remind yourself as a um, an LSU fan, mind you. Rebuilding year. Brian Kelly doesn't have many of his guys here. First year with this system, right? Asking for consistency both in the passing and running game. Every single SEC game is not going to be there, right? Rivalry games are weird, right? You play a you play a team weird when it's a rivalry game, right? Ole Miss is one, um, Alabama's one. We I think last year we LSU played Alabama tough, but uh, so so anyway, to end this, set your expectations low, right? Just look at the matchups. From most accounts, whatever the good matchup is from, but national media, local media, 
new media as well says is a good matchup, then you should expect a, ho- a good game from LSU. And that's all I expect, some good games from LSU this year. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.